Hello and welcome to this edition of Kids to Praise training video. If you're watching this, you're getting ready for Kids to Praise this coming Sunday, April 22nd, 2012. We're very excited. We're on our second week of our new series called Level Up. And this week we're talking about Jesus gives his power from gets his power from God. And our verse is Be Strong in the Lord from Ephesians 6:10. The story comes out of Matthew 12, verses 22 through 29. And so as the kids get in, you want to welcome them and set up the Play-Doh and the puzzles and things they can play with. And then you'll take them to small group time and you'll have some supplies of a rock, paper, uh, a spoon, plastic, a plastic spoon, yarn, thread, uh, and have all these in the bag and talk about which of these is strong and which of these is not as strong. So when they hold, first they're going to hold the paper ball as opposed to the rock and which one's heavier and which one would be stronger and then they'll set up two piles one that's a stronger pile one that's a weaker pile and then you'll talk to them about how things are can be stronger than other than and there are things that are weaker and name how Jesus is stronger as opposed to how uh, people can be weaker sometimes and so then we're going to talk about how Jesus healed a man who was uh, had evil things inside of him and how Jesus made, uh, was even stronger than what seemed like it was very strong inside that man. So you'll talk about that. Then you're going to have circle time on the mat where you'll sing and you'll pray and you'll share this Bible story and you'll work on your memory verse, be strong in the Lord, and then say that no matter how hard you try, you aren't able to do things by yourself, uh, like breaking yarn or, or things that are very hard. But when you use scissors to cut it, it it's easier because scissors are stronger than the yarn. And it talks about how our faith in God is even the fact that we can feel like we're not very strong or weak. Um, God is still strong and God will take care of us. Then your craft time, you'll be making a Bible bookmark and you'll be putting a scripture sticker on the back and they'll be able to color the back. And then you'll put um, another sticker on the front that covers up the Miyama because we got these in Spanish. And we're covering the Miyama up and put the sticker of Jesus is strong. And then uh, after that, there'll be large group time for uh, the kindergartners. And of course, if you're twos, threes and fours, you'll have gone to large group time first and do these activities after. So remember to be there at 9 o'clock on Sunday, bright and early. Um, we want to really want to encourage you to be there as quickly and as early as possible. We've got so many activities going on in Austin. Sometimes you don't always know how the traffic's going to be coming to church. So make sure you give yourself plenty of time to get there early so that we can be there to receive the kids when they get there. Hope you all have a great week, and we will look forward to seeing you on Sunday.